chosen as man of the match today. Unfortunately, not a clean sheet, but I don't think you could have really done much about that goal today, could you? It was quite surreal because he, he controlled it and then I thought, he's not going to shoot. And then the next minute, it's in the goal. So um, I think it was a pretty good strike. I have to look back at it because I was disappointed anyway, but it was... Uh, was a hell of a strike. But obviously, you know, I mean, we've we've come to grow accustomed to a, a, you pulling off some really good saves. You made another two or three out there today. It's you know, it, is, is that part of your game? Quick reflexes, because it does seem to be. Yeah, we do we do do a lot of work in um, on the training pitch in terms of reflexes and all the outcomes we can have on the pitch. Um, reflexes are more sort of you know reactive things. You don't really think about it. Um, sometimes you're in the right position. Sometimes you're not. So it's one of those sort of things you just have to gamble and being in the right position at the right time. Unfortunately, one of them was was offside, but um, we won't mention that. <laughs> We've obviously, you know, we haven't actually kept many clean sheets this season, have we? Has that been a target of yours to kind of improve? I know it's not obviously solely down to you. You've done as much as you can, but is that something you want to see improved? Yeah, every every game, the clean sheet is the aim. For me, I can't really win the game. Mm -hmm. I can only just try and not let the goals in. So that is the aim. Um, but if we, we do concede a goal, then the aim is to not concede another goal. Um, so, yeah, clean sheet's always the aim, but we've had a we had a clean sheet against Maidstone, so we try and build on that, but you know, if we if, it, if one goes in, we just try and not allow two. So, yeah. It's obviously, well, it's your, it's your first proper real first team season in men's football, isn't it? Obviously, you were at Stockport last year, but you didn't get too many games. So, it is a learning experience, isn't it? And, and you are just kind of developing as a player still. You're only young. So, how have you found the first half of the season? Yeah, it's been really good. It's been a lot of ups and downs. Sometimes we have our, our run of games where we win three or four on the bounce. Sometimes we have um, a few games where we don't we don't get the results we want. Um, so it's all it's all learning. We've got sort of six games in a row here, and our home form isn't isn't fantastic compared to our away form. So it'll be it's a great opportunity to um, to correct that. We've obviously seen Hadji come in, but you know with Corey, Tyler, Ollie, it's been a very settled kind of defence in front of you so you kind of developing a bit of a well not partnership but a, a, a bond with those guys yeah the boys at the front in front of me are our top draw in terms of you've got Hadji, Corey and, and Tyler who head everything pretty much and clear everything which makes my job easier you've got Ollie who's probably one of the best crosses in the in the league um, and also loves a tackle mm. um, so th those boys in front of me makes the job uh, a lot easier <laughs> Click here for the latest match highlights and click here to subscribe. Are you in with a shot? Look below for more information.